Inflate a balloon. Let's try to inflate a balloon without blowing into it or even using a pump. Mixing vinegar and baking soda releases carbon dioxide gas. If you add the two together and quickly attach a balloon to the container and close any other openings, the balloon will inflate with carbon dioxide. You will need some vinegar, sodium bicarbonate, also known as baking soda, a balloon, a funnel, red food coloring, a spoon, and a narrow-necked bottle. Let's see how it is done, shall we? Add a few drops of food coloring to the vinegar to make it red. Now your vinegar is red in color. Put this vinegar into the narrow-necked bottle until it is one-fourth full. Use the funnel to fill the balloon with sodium bicarbonate powder. Attach the mouth of the balloon to the neck of the bottle. While doing so, make sure the sodium bicarbonate does not fall out of the balloon. So please do it carefully. Lift the balloon and make sure that sodium bicarbonate falls into the bottle. The vinegar begins to bubble and the balloon slowly starts to expand. Do you know why this is happening? This is because the vinegar is reacting with the sodium bicarbonate to produce bubbles of carbon dioxide gas. As more and more gas is formed, the balloon expands more. It was fun, wasn't it? Now, can you tell me how this was done? You made a gas called carbon dioxide and this gas entered the balloon, expanding it. Carbon dioxide is the gas which forms bubbles in soda. So remember, science is not just science, it's magic.